Hey, Darian, wait up. <laughs> hey, how you doing, Katie? Uh, actually, it's... Uh, <clears throat> Katie's doing fine. All right. <laughs> Thanks for asking. Um, I actually have to ask you a favor. I know that you're the head of the dance committee, and I really want a DJ at tomorrow's dance. Sorry, I wish I could help, but DJ Mike's already doing it. See you later, Katie. You don't know me. And I mean literally because my name is Casey. But I don't really take no for an answer, so how about you just let me DJ at the dance and uh, let's not make this weird. Uh, it's already gotten weird. Oh, hey, Miss G, I was looking at my schedule. Uh, Darian, I was kind of already talking to Mrs. G. Um, of course, just send them right over and I will tutor away. Well, yeah, well, see, I was just trying Again, to... Again, Darian, please. Okay, the world does not revolve around you. <laughs> uh, just have them get in contact with me and I'd be happy to help. Thank you. Darian, contact Casey. <laughs> oh, look at that. You're the student that needs help. <laughs> well, let me check my schedule. I am available for you around never. Well, is it because I'm so good looking and you don't trust yourself alone with me? <laughs> Oh, so you have a bad grasp on math and reality. Come on, I really need your help to pass math. Oh, you know, kind of like you helped me when I was trying to DJ at the dance? Maybe I should help you. You know, you can sit there and study, right? And I'll stand behind you and yell really supportive things like, you stink, you can't act, you got 99 problems and you can't solve one. So, uh, right after school today? Give me one good reason why I should help you. It would be a distraction. I'll see you at 3 o'clock. Well, obviously, when using matrix M, it's inverse. So matrix M to the negative 1 exists if and only if the determinant of M does not equal 0. This is pre-calculus? What happens when I get to actual calculus? Slow down. OK, OK, fine. I'm sorry. I forgot I had to go at jock speed. <laughs> Obviously, when using Matrix M, and no, I'm not talking about the movie with Keanu Reeves. What are you doing? I'm tutoring you. Really? Because it feels like you're just cracking on me. Are you saying I need a tutor to tutor me and tutoring you? Casey, I really need to pass this test or I can't play in the big game. I'm sure the school is not going to bench their star player because of one bad grade. No, they won't, but my dad will. And I promised him I wouldn't let football interfere with my grades. And I don't want to disappoint my dad. Wow. Uh, okay. All right. Well, I'll take this seriously if you do. Okay. Let's work and let's get you that A. I'd be good with the C. Yeah. Good. I'm real time. <laughs> Even if you did me a ski ball. <laughs> I'll beat you. Excuse me. I pummeled you. I guess you just can't handle how I roll. Hey, in my defense, I was distracted by a beautiful girl. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Good night. I really like you. I mean, my life can be kind of stressful sometimes. Well, more like all the time, but when I'm with you, I just, I forget about all of that, you know? You just, you let me be me, you know? I Just regular boring Casey. And I have no idea why you like me so much, but I'm really glad that you do. Because I really, really want you to be my boyfriend. Oh my god, I kissed you out of a coma. Actually, you kissed me out of a nap. Oh, <laughs> okay. Um, so, you're gonna be all right? Yeah, I just have a broken arm and a slight concussion. They're gonna keep me another day or so for observation. Okay, that, that's great. That's, um, I, I'd hug you, but, you know, you couldn't really hug me back because the arm, so... High five! Hey, yeah. Woo. <laughs> So, what's exactly the plan here? Are we gonna pretend like you didn't just say you wanted me to be your boyfriend? Okay, did I say that? Or did you dream that? No, I think you said it. <laughs> no, I, I, I think you imagined it because of the drugs they gave you. You mean the antibiotics? Yes. Uh, no, of course, you know, antibiotic hallucinations. It's 100% medically accurate, despite what your doctor will tell you after I leave. <laughs> Oh, okay. <laughs> we should probably know. 
I want to be a boyfriend. Really? Really. Are you sure that's not just antibiotics talking? <laughs> I'm really glad you're okay. Me too. <laughs> Casey, guess what? I get out tomorrow. The doctor said in a couple days, I'll be ready for that ski ball rematch. Uh, Darian, I'm not into you. <laughs> what are you talking about? I like you, you like me, things are going great. No, they're not. Well, not for me. Oh. Oh, I get it. It's the boyfriend-girlfriend thing. Like, if you want, we can slow it down. Darian, you're not listening, okay? I don't like you. I'm breaking up with you. No. No, this makes no sense. This isn't right. Something else must be going on. Casey, talk to me. Take care, Darian. I was not staring at you. I was staring at nothing. I'm not, I'm, no, 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 no. I'm not saying that you're nothing. I'm just, I mean, you're definitely something, but I'm just, I'm just saying that I was, I wasn't staring at you. I was like staring past you at the pinball machine. It just, it's so many beautiful colors. Hey, can I ask you a question? Yeah, no, sure, absolutely. Whatever you ask me, I will probably say yes. <laughs> I once fell asleep in class and woke up in the middle of a chess club meeting. Does that count as extracurricular activity? No, that counts as narcolepsy. <laughs> you might want to see a doctor about that. Why are you asking? I'm trying to beef up my application at Morehouse College. He doesn't have the grades for that, and that's probably why this isn't going to work out. <laughs> Wait, but, but if you think about it, Morehouse, that, that's right next to where I want to go to school. Wait a minute, that, that's, that's a signal. Okay, Darian, look. I get it. You like me. <laughs> Excuse me? You're applying to go to Morehouse, which is right next to school. I want to go to Spelman, and you want us to be girlfriend and boyfriend, and you're clearly afraid of long-distance relationships. I mean, I'm not stupid. Actually, I want to go to Morehouse because my father went there, and my grandfather, and three of my uncles. Okay, maybe I'm a little stupid. <laughs> What's going on with you, Casey? Sorry, I'm a little embarrassed. I just thought that you were, like, giving off signals that you want to be a couple or something. <laughs> I'm just really bad at this. Well, maybe not as bad as you think. Maybe we should give the dating thing another try. Okay, I'm just sorry. Just to be clear, when you say that you want to give the dating thing another try, you mean that we We sh should give the dating thing another try, okay. yeah? <laughs> cool. <Ooh. laughs> I knew he wanted to be my boyfriend. Oh. I'm here to pick up Casey for a date. And you show up here in jeans and a t-shirt? Have you ever heard of the expression, dress to impress? We're going to the baseball game. Huh. In that case, cool Dutch. <laughs> now look here, I like you, son. I always have. But if you break my daughter's heart one more time, I will break you. <laughs> Mr. Cooper, actually, she was the one who broke my heart. And you came back for more? What's wrong with you, boy? Get some self-respect and move on. <laughs> okay, what Mr. Cooper's trying to say is have a nice time. But if Casey's not home by 11, you're gonna be in jail by 12. You understand that? You ever been in jail, boy? I don't think huh? he is. We hey, know hey, people. Hey, mom, Dad, hey, hey, hey. I do not need you to embarrass me in front of my date. I can do that all on my own. I'm just... Yeah, let's go. <laughs> Want some popcorn? Oh, I'm good. Nachos. <laughs> you know, this is nice. Just the two of us chilling. Hey! Hey! I saw that blue. Listen, I've seen potatoes with better eyes. The strike zone is chest to knees. That's right, chest to knees! <laughs> Sorry, got a little carried away. <laughs> Doesn't bother me. Sorry about that. I just 
just ruined our first kiss tonight. Actually, you ruined our first kiss last year. You just ruined our second first kiss. <laughs> this this date, date is not, not going, going as well as, well as I, I thought it would. Why you didn't hear about the earthquake on the news? Because. Mr. Moneypenny, remember him? Yeah, he called his cousin, and I'm not really at liberty to say what happened on that fishing expedition, but uh, suffice to say, three went out, two came back. Yeah, how dumb do you think I am? Okay, fine. I was constipated for six hours, and I shouldn't have eaten all that cheese. Casey, stop. All right? I know exactly why you disappeared. You do? Yeah. It's because I tried to kiss you. What? I was the one who said we should go slow, and I went too fast. I guess I got caught up by the whole kiss cam thing. That's no excuse. And I never should have done that. Because I don't even know if this is right. Oh, thank goodness. <laughs> wait, 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 excuse me? I am so glad you said that. Because, well, honestly, I was, I was feeling that way too. This is not right, Darian, and I don't know. I just didn't say anything because last time I'm the one who disappointed you. So. Honestly, I just think we're better off as friends. friends. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> we cool? Yeah, we're cool. Uh, maybe. We should... There we go. <laughs>